The Vancouver Police Department showed off the results of a March 11th drug bust today in a storage unit in East Vancouver. The bust, titled Operation Trooper, involved 11 search warrants, all of which were executed at the same time throughout Metro Vancouver. Police seized $1.8 million worth of drugs, including cocaine, heroin, methamphetamine, and fentanyl, along with $575,000 worth of cash, 12 firearms, and 7 vehicles. Certainly that the Vancouver Police has been involved in. Uh, this is one of the larger ones. In the bulk form, it's $1.8 million, but the, the value is exponentially higher at the street level, so I, I expect that this will have an impact. The VPD is recommending charges against 11 people involved for drugs and firearm offenses. These individuals were known to the police quite well. Um, we, during the course of the investigation, obviously identified more individuals, but when we target individuals in, in projects like this, it's because we know what their activities are, and usually there's violence attached to it, so that's why they get targeted. They're mostly local. Police found 23,000 pills pressed and stamped to look like oxycodone, but were in fact fentanyl, a far more powerful and dangerous opiate. The coordinated busts occurred in a variety of locations. There were some houses in some nice residential areas. There, there were storage lockers. There were, there were houses, houses in the downtown east side. There were stash houses in, the, in, in Vancouver, not far from here. Two heavily armed police officers from the VPD Emergency Response Unit stood outside the storage unit, guarding the cash, drugs, and weapons inside. This, this is the method. For the Langara Voice, I'm Nick Johansson.